All right, welcome everybody. So today I'm gonna to be going over how to add ASCII art to your terminal. So this is something that sometimes you see in movies or um, you find people having some crazy designs in their terminals. Um, let's go ahead and get started. So what you first want to do is that you want to open up a, a, a fresh terminal in your Linux, or this also works in uh, any Unix based system for the most part. So you could follow along. You could just look up your terminal and in terminal, you get this big screen coming up and you need to edit something called the dot bash RC file. And we could see that by displaying all hidden content and all content in the terminal, that's what this dash A stands for. So uh, the bash RC file is this one. This is what loads up anything right before the bash starts. So every single time you start a new uh, terminal, it basically launches. So let's go into it. I'm gonna use gedit, but to go into bash rc. And basically this comes up. As you can see, I already have a couple of things on here. Um, so, what you want to do is just go from here and then scroll all the way to the bottom. And down here, what you want to do is that you want to echo whatever ASCII art you want. So in this example, I'm just going to start off with something like, um, echo, uh, hello, working the code. Bam. So this is done. So now we save, we exit, and when we open up a new bash, it loads in. Hello, working the code. And this applies to everything. So what I want to do is that um, you could go on Firefox and just look up like uh, ASCII art and first link, whatever. You could find whatever you want. Um, I'm gonna go to I'm gonna go ahead and go to space and I like aliens so why not we could do forgive the slowness this is a virtual machine here we could do this one I like this one so let's just go ahead and we're gonna control C to copy and once we do this, what I want to do is, it doesn't matter what window you do this, but I'm just gonna go back to the one that I was before and edit that bash RC file once again. And we're going to copy over that ASCII art. And this should work. We save, we exit, we have one new terminal and bam, we have this cool ASCII art now on our screen. Um, Keep in mind that you do need to open up a new terminal for this to work and for it to reflect. Don't forget to save, and I hope this was useful. All right, working the code out.